So after the Lombok trip, we went back to Bali and decided to stay at Jimboran Bay. We had a wedding gift card for four seasons, so we thought we'd celebrate our one year anniversary here. This is gonna be my honest thoughts, feelings, and experience, so enjoy! We just checked in at a story villa last night. We arrived around like seven-ish, so we just got takeout, slept, woke up, had breakfast at a nearby-ish cafe, and then we're gonna check into the Four Seasons, but we'll be enjoying, probably just chilling after two weeks of abusing our bodies. <laughs> we decided to just walk from our villa to Four Seasons because it's like a 15 minute walk. It's like a far walk. No, it's a short walk, but there's no sidewalk. But I feel like it's too short to get a taxi. Oh, we're here already. Wait, we're just gonna wait a little bit until we get to check into our room. Yeah. Just exploring. That's Jim Baran Bay. No surf. It's like a sauna. Ice cream soup is what they called it. It feels so weird to like relax at a resort. I feel like every time we're at a hotel or resort, we're working. Mm Reflect. We got us an anniversary cake. I'm so grateful for this time and for my family for this gift. And I just want to work harder next year so one day we can give back, you know. It feels surreal to be here. So getting used to filming content, <laughs> but I'm excited for our future. I think there's like a part of me that feels like I don't deserve it, but it's like, just gotta work harder. Thank you Four Seasons <laughs> for this cake. You see? It's like a strawberry cake.
They brought us a Christmas cake. Like another present? Uh, yeah, Christmas present. We made a reservation for dinner. It's a little late, 8.30, because we had a late lunch. some fruits, all these beautiful fruits, and some bread. We had a really big dinner. Service was great, food was good. He's <laughs> showing up on the bread, there's so much bread. Originally, we were gonna go to Uluwatu today, but I think we decided that we're just gonna chill. <laughs> Maybe edit at most, but I think we're gonna just take advantage of this beautiful resort and chill, go to the different pools and just relax. I've never been like a vacationer where you like stay at a resort and chill. I've never done that before. I mean, this resort is so nice. <laughs> it feels like a waste not to take advantage of it. This one has all the food stuff if you want to look at it. Taking muddy skies, you want me to be just me. Now I'm ready, life. You forced me back to basics. check out and then maybe check out uh what is it Jim Brown Bay area because our flight is quite late how do you feel staying at Four Seasons for the first time instead of working at a Four Seasons it's like almost overwhelming to be asked every 10 minutes do I need anything is everything mm -hmm. okay mm -hmm. and like no, the service is great yeah. we're not used to it maybe because yeah. we're we're usually on the other side I think so it feels kind of weird great experience grateful for the for this gift comes with like a sense of guilt or something I don't know what it is I don't know if it's like imposter syndrome or guilt or I just have a lot on my mind and it feels like I cannot edit this video without sharing my thoughts true thoughts part of my mindset is like oh you know like this is great and we deserve rest and you know you're paying for this experience and then there's like this other side of me that's just like uncomfortable and i wanted to create more content right so then when we decided to stay up for seasons i was like oh i want to film you know the space and share our experience and all of that but i don't want it to come off like oh like this is what I'm used to and this is um, normal I don't want to put a false version of myself online like there's always going to be that disconnect between who we put online and who we really are I think that's what happens when there's a camera in front of you there's always going to be like a slight gap but I want to keep that gap as small as possible which is why I'm unnecessarily talking about this. So this might be unnecessary rambling and overthinking, but also I'm like, you know, this is what I would be talking 
talking to my friends about, like my real honest thoughts about my experience and how everything was great and relaxing and amazing. But also there's a part of me that's uncomfortable and feels like shit, you know? I can't even organize my thoughts. I don't exactly know what I was trying to convey here. I just felt a mix of emotions and wanted to stay as honest to you and myself as possible. I think working in Hawaii where we cater to tourists, we film at Four Seasons a lot and I wasn't used to being on the other side and I don't know if you guys have ever felt like this before if you did I would love to hear your experience thoughts or if you feel like Reina just shut up and enjoy it you can tell me that too the chili paste thing. I wonder if you can buy like a jar. You probably can. Yeah. It was so crazy humid this day that we decided to just head to the airport and we booked this capsule hotel at the airport for six hours so we were able to shower and chill in the AC before checking in and we just did some work and seriously just like chilled in the AC. And I quickly want to mention that we had a layover before our Lombard trip where we stayed at the Novelto Hotel. And I know this almost sounds sponsored, but it's not. I just want to let you know if you ever have a layover in Bali and you need a convenient place to stay, then this is your place. And lastly, if you made it this far and you're a new subscriber or a returning subscriber, I just want to say thank you so much because I just made 2,000 subscribers and I'm just trying to celebrate like these little wins. So yeah, thank you always for taking the time to join me here and see you soon.